What is up you guys, it is Sam here and today I'm going to teach you how to install Forge for all versions of Minecraft 1.5 on your Mac. Here we go. So the first thing you want to do is open up your favorite web browser of choice and type in Minecraft Forge into your Google search bar. And then you want to click the first link right here which is Minecraft Forums. You will then be taken to the home page. After that, in the forum section down here, scroll down and click releases. In releases, go to Forge 7.7.0 Minecraft 1.5. And remember, this will gradually change as different versions of Minecraft 1.5 come out. So for now, since this is just regular 1.5, click that. And then click direct download right there. And that will go into your downloads folder. So let's just minimize that. Now what you want to do is open up terminal and in terminal type ch flags no hidden just like that a I will paste this code in the description below so you guys can put this in a terminal if you don't really feel like typing it and then press enter and then when we look in our finder the library folder is there that's nice so let's just exit out of terminal and now go into library application support Minecraft and then there are specific files you need to save and files you need to delete so the ones that you want to save are your servers.dat file your stats file your saves file your texture packs file and um, that should just be about it then select everything in the folder right click it and click move to trash now what you want to do is open up the Minecraft application and then wait and then go to username and put in your username as so as so like that let me just put in the password click remember password and click login and it will download all of the packages needed for the latest version of Minecraft so let's just let it do that And of course, there is this glitch for some reason whenever downloading 1.5 files. So to simply solve this, go to the Apple logo in your menu bar, click force quit, go to Minecraft, force quit, and force quit just like that. Reopen Minecraft, click login, and Minecraft should open up just fine. As you can see, Minecraft is fine, and all of the files have been written in the folder click quit game and now in your minecraft folder and application support go to bin and click your minecraft.jar press enter and change the extension to dot zip like that click use dot zip all right very good and now double click the file to unzip it and then delete the dot zip file and now go back to your Minecraft folder right here select everything that you dragged on your desktop your servers.dat file your stats file your saves file and your texture packs and your texture pack and bring it here click apply to all and click replace just like that then go back to your bin go to your Minecraft folder right here and rename it to dot jar as so and then scroll down in your new minecraft.jar folder and delete your meta inf file so I'm just gonna go find that and there it is right click it and click move to trash and now go into your downloads folder and bring up your minecraft forge zip file double click it to unzip the file and when we look at our minecraft forge file we have plenty and plenty of class files so you want to select all of the class files simply scroll down select the one on the bottom and then press shift and select the one on the top to select them all and then drag them into your minecraft.jar folder click apply to all and click replace just like that now to make sure that we were successful we need to have a successful minecraft login so I'm going to open up minecraft here and I'm going to press login now as you can see it's working it is downloading all the forge files so let's just wait for it to go validating to make sure it's good 
and do not click stop. All right. And uh, let's see if it worked. All right, as you can see, success, a successful install of Minecraft Forge has been performed. And yes, if you can look down here, you should see text similar to this after installing. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this helped you. And um, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave a comment below. I would be very, very happy to answer that. And um, if you want to subscribe to this channel to stay tuned in for more gaming, tech, tutorials, and reviews, feel free to hit that subscribe button on the screen or down below, depending on what device you are on. And um, if you really like this video and if the video helps you out, hit that like button down below as well. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Sam, signing off.